Hello, I'm Mr. Frolkins and I'm gonna play my little investigation that is saw. My little pony detective game. And this is the demo case of the game, so let's start this and see how it is. I look so I'm gonna not talk about over them. Found it! Find it! It's here somewhere! Nah! I'm looking! Give me a break! It's too dark! Can't see a thing! Yes! That's a thing called mouse! Keep looking! Wait! I think! Aha! I found it! Finally! Let's get out of here! Quickly! Skepticism? Well, I shall have you know that last night I became a victim! A tragic, tragic victim! Woe is me! I shall never recover from this injury that's been wrought upon me! English, Rarity. <sighs> I was in the zone, Twilight. But if I must, last night I was stolen from! Stolen from? What was stolen? They were stolen, Twilight! Both of them! Uh... My two jewels! True Blue and Opal! Ahem. Twilight, what Rarity is trying to say is that thieves broke into the carousel boutique last night and stole both the True Blue, a large sapphire that she had recently acquired when gem hunting, and Opal, which is her, uh, her cat. How could they? How could they? Oh, my poor, poor darling, all alone out there with those... THOSE RUFFIANS! I'm gonna go ahead and hope that she was talking about her cat there. What happened? Do you have any idea who did this? Well, no. I'm afraid we haven't the slightest idea. Ponyville doesn't really have much of a police force, you see. So we are a little... under-equipped to handle something like this. This doesn't happen very often, you know. An investigative team from Canterlot has agreed to look into it, but I'm afraid they won't be here for a few days. A few days? But the thieves might be long gone by then, and... Wait, is this the same investigative team as last time? Exactly what happened last time? I can't seem to recall. The one brought in to investigate the baby that went missing and which ended up being found unharmed in the closet? Ah, yes. I do recall that. But I'm not sure where you're going with... The one that somehow managed to implicate Pinkie Pie in a fictional Dragon X smuggling ring? Well, uh... Yes. Yes, that's the one. Think positive, Twilight. They may, uh... perform better this time. Yes, that's the ticket. Well, there's not much for it either way, Twilight. After all, no pony in our town has any experience with this sort of thing. We'll just have to wait it out. Oh, I have so much to do at the moment. I simply can't stay around any longer. We'll get to the bottom of this as soon as that investigative team arrives, Rarity. You have my word. <sighs> I'm afraid she's right, you know. We shall simply have to wait it out. If that investigative team gets their hooks on this case, who knows what ridiculous things they might come up with this time. There has to be a better way. Rarity? I'm on the case. I beg your pardon, Twilight? Some pony needs to get to the bottom of this, right? Well, I volunteer. I've had experience investigating crime before, after all. Twilight, I'm really not sure if that's such a grand idea. Well, I mean, sure. That particular investigation pretty much involved completely airtight evidence that directly identified the culprits in one go. And it also included an eyewitness who saw almost everything who could lead me exactly to the clues. But it's not like the team from Canterlot will be much better, right? Forgive me, Twilight, if your words do not inspire a great deal of confidence. It'll be fine. Don't you worry, Rarity. 
I'll have this case wrapped up in a jiffy. Mystery novels came through for me then, so surely they'll come through for us again. I wonder where Pinkie Pie's been today. If she were here, I feel like she might say something like, Hey Twilight, you're in a video game! Or, now if you want to move Twilight, you gotta just click where you want to go, or you can also just press and hold too! She might even say something like, Now if you want to interact with something, well then you just click on it too, silly Billy! But, sadly, she isn't here right now. Let's investigate. Hmm. The star maybe say a bit? A strange star-shaped object? I can't say I know what this is, but it looks out of place, which makes it a clue in my book. Oof, so we found some evidence? Hmm, well, it doesn't take a sharp eye to see that these are tire marks, and it doesn't take a sharp wit to figure out that whoever was here probably was the cause of this broken window, too. Is there anything else here? Yeah, some hair. Is this hair? Hmm. Huh. These tire tracks and this hair seem like they go together. What was it? Oh, right! If I want to combine them, I just click on Evidence in the main screen. Click on the tracks, then Combine with. Click on the hair, and then click Combine. As Pinky might say, Easy peasy! Okay, so let's combine them. Combined. If we assume that this hair is from some animal, then it'd naturally follow that the rider probably swerved here to avoid hitting it, explaining why that pony went towards the window. Except, what animal was it? A pony, perhaps? Hmm. Some more evidence? A piece of cloth. Red on one side, gold on the other? I think I know what this is from. Maybe it rarity knows a little more about his cape. I think it's from the Kuzmata Crusaders, but see who left it there. Oh, I remember this little problem. Of course! Apple Bloom came by this morning to have this little accident fixed up. She seemed to have ripped her cape during one of her usual excursions. I asked her why she didn't just get Sweetie Belle to fix it up, but she said that Sweetie Belle was very busy today and couldn't spare any time to do so. I really don't know what those fillies are up to, but on the other half, perhaps it's better I don't know. I swear, sometimes I don't understand myself. Sweetie Belle absolutely ruins my gold silk and now here I am, fixing the capes they made with it. I'm an odd sort. Do you think I'm odd, Twilight? Oh, Rarity. I think you just have a big heart. <sighs> Don't remind me, Twilight. Sometimes it can be a bit tiresome. So this belonged to Apple. And she had it fixed this morning. Okay. Hmm. Explain more about the crime. Oh yeah, there's a dialogue in here. So let's start it to see what happened. Rarity, I think we should start with what happened last night. Of course, darling. What would you like to know? Could you describe exactly what happened and what you saw? Well, I'm afraid there isn't much to tell. I was sleeping in my bedroom when suddenly I heard a shrill crash from downstairs. I went downstairs to investigate, and what did I find but my house overturned and ransacked? My prized jewel gone, and my beloved Opal Essence missing as well! Oh, Opal! Mama's coming soon! Hmm, perhaps I should ask more specifically about what was stolen. And that was everything there is to speak of? You saw nothing else at all? No, nothing I'm afraid. So sorry, Twilight. That sounded awfully suspicious. Rarity, are you hiding something? I should come back when I've got some evidence proving that Rarity knows more than she's letting on. Presenting that to her should get her to talk to me. Could you describe everything that was stolen last night? Of course! First there was True Blue, a regular hunk of a sapphire that shone in the light like a noonday sky. 
Oh, whatever shall I do without the light of that jewel in my workshop? Second, that was Opal. My darling, darling Opal! She's been missing since last night, too. Now with the jewel, I can understand, but what could the thieves possibly want with Opal? It greatly troubles me to think of what might have happened to her. You must find them both, Twilight. Promise me. You must. You must! I'll do my best, Rarity. I promise. Not just a giant sapphire, but her cat, too? What an equestria could that be about? I just learned about the cat bear, so... I think the hair on the ground bear... Bear... Should uh, combine with the kitty cat. So let's see. Cat and hair combined. Oh yeah, All that right. was right. Let's think about this logically here. Hair this color and this length is pretty rare. As far as equestrian goes, there really aren't any ponies that it could have come from. In fact, the only creature that I can think of that it could have come from is Opalescence. And that would mean that whoever was here swerved and crashed into the window because Opalescence was in his or her path. And that would all come together to mean that this broken window likely was an accident. It feels like there's more to this than just that. But it's a start at least. So let's talk to the rarity about it. Let's present the kitty cat. Oh, Opal, you poor, poor darling! All alone in the wilderness! Why, Twilight, what if she's been eaten by a manticore? Or a dragon? Or a hydra? Or maybe she's up a tree somewhere. By Celestia's name! Don't scare me with such propositions! You know what? I'm not even gonna comment. Why, thank you, dog. I Let's see again. It should be something with cat. Oh! Or by, you know... Crusaders. Done any, you know, epic quests or crusading lately? Oh, well, uh, no, actually, not really. See, we're kind of on break. On break? Since when do the cutie mark crusaders take breaks? Since, well, recently. I mean, every pony's gotta take a break once in a while, right? How recently? Uh, pretty recent? <sighs> Why is she avoiding my questions? Something's not right here. Although, now that I think about it, there's one crusader I haven't heard anything about today. Say, Apple Bloom, do you know where Scootaloo's been? Uh, nowhere. I, I mean, somewhere! I mean, not here! I mean, I don't know! Uh-huh. So, did you hear about what happened to Rarity last night? Did I? That was an awful thing that happened to her! Well, don't worry. I'm on the case. And I promise you that I'll find the one who broke that window and stole from her. Oh, uh, well, uh, good luck with that. Hope you have real good luck there! That was an odd response. Apple Bloom, you wouldn't happen to know anything about what happened, would you? Huh? Course not! Why would you think I'm not telling you something, huh? Because, because you, just you just told me that you're not. Okay, okay Apple Bloom. Time, time to find, to find out, out what you're hiding. Let's see. Apple Bloom, I need to ask you about where you were around the time of the crime. Huh? How come? I'm not a suspect, am I? No, no, I just need to know. Procedure and all. That makes sense, right? Uh, sure, I guess. I wasn't really doing a whole lot yesterday, to be perfectly honest. Most of my day was spent with Applejack helping her on the farm. What were you doing on the farm, if you don't mind me asking? The usual. Applejack and Big Macintosh were bucking the apple trees, and I was helping out with the bucket. I'm a big pony and all, but my bucket legs can't get the job done yet, 
so I'm still just helping move around the apple.